Hi, everyone. I want to share my experience with this Sin and Foul perfume oil set that I purchased at TJ Maxx for $12.99. The packaging for this trio is simple and pretty. I love that there is a sturdy foam insert that separates each oil and keeps them in place. Unfortunately, the individual bottles had issues with the caps twisting down all the way, and the bottles were not filled completely. I did not have any issues with the oil spillage, though. Now, let's talk about each scent. Jasmine and cedar wood has notes of saffron, lemon, jasmine, pine, and cedar wood. This is my favorite fragrance of the set. It smells like an expensive lemon cake with woody notes. Unfortunately, this fragrance is very faint. It projects and lasts, but I barely notice it on my skin. One time while wearing this, I actually thought I was smelling someone else's fragrance. I wish this one performed well on me. I am seeing some people compare this to Baccarat 540, which affirms my opinion that this smells luxurious. Santal and cardamom has fragrance notes of eucalyptus, bergamot, cardamom, and sandalwood. This fragrance is very heavy and woody. It's almost cologne-like with the strength that it has. I actually rinsed this off of my skin and still smelled it about an hour or so later. To me, this fragrance smells aquatic and spicy. With the dry down, the bergamot lightens it up a bit. I gifted this to my brother who loves expensive fragrance and he let me know that he really likes it. Vanilla Musk has fragrance notes of coconut, anise, vanilla, and musk. This scent starts off as a very creamy vanilla and musk scent. With the dry down, the coconut becomes more prominent. This reminded me a lot of the smell of the Sol de Janeiro Bum Bum Cream with less of an artificial smell. Unfortunately, coconut is a fragrance note that can smell weird on me. I noticed the coconut started to smell like softy coconut grease on me, which was comforting at first, but overwhelmed me after a couple of minutes. This had great projection and lasted on me about the same as the jasmine and cedar would. Overall, I had high hopes for these fragrances due to my positive experiences with other fragrance oils, but these let me down. I did learn that lemon works well on my skin and coconut does not. I won't be repurchasing these oils in the future, but I could see them working for someone else. Thanks for watching. Please like, like subscribe, and comment. All right, bye.